Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joe, and welcome to another episode of mine and Spikey's joint series, where we go over some cosmetics for each class in the game that we feel are slightly overrated. Just as a quick disclaimer, if we say the cosmetic is overrated, it doesn't necessarily mean it's bad, so please don't get offended if your sniper uh, loadout consists of any of these cosmetics. As I said, they're not bad, I just feel like they're a bit overrated, and I guess are a bit more popular than I feel that they should be. However, I have nothing against the cosmetics in this video. There's only a couple more episodes left in this series, so do be sure to go and check out Spikey's channel in the description below if you haven't seen any of the episodes so far. And if you would like to catch up on the series, and if you would like to stay tuned for more episodes, then once again, do go and check out Spikey down in the description below. Without further ado, let's get into the first cosmetic. So the first sniper cosmetic that I feel is extremely overrated has got to be the villain's veil. You can't go in, uh, I'd say one in every three servers without finding a sniper that's wearing the villain's veil. And don't get me wrong, in the style that you guys are seeing on the, on the screen right now, I think it's quite a cool misc, I think it looks really great. However, I just feel like there's pretty good alternatives out there. I prefer the way the bruiser's bandana looks and that can be worn on all classes as well. So that's my reasoning for it, I think there's better alternatives out there. And I mean, a strange villain's veil is what, like three keys or so? So it's a pretty pricey misc. So the first hat that I think is overrated for the sniper is the anger. Now with the anger, I think it's kind of overrated because it stops you from putting on another face cosmetic unless it's like a master's yellow belt or a max's severed head because then like they, they don't have, really have equip regions and the master's yellow belt works with the anger anyway. But other than that, you might actually be stuck for a third cosmetic to wear on the sniper if you're wearing a shirt already because the anger is like a whole face cosmetic cosmetic and while that does look cool it is kind of annoying when you're trying to have a third cosmetic and don't really know what to put on and honestly the anger does look good it's just so overused and so many people use it it just starts to get really boring to look at and you know it doesn't really seem like it's worth that many people using because there's so much better cosmetic sets out there for the sniper so I don't really see why the anger is used as much as it is. So next up on the list we have the snow scoper. The snow scoper, you can't really see it too much here, but it's a jacket worn by the sniper. Now don't get me wrong, once again, I think this is a really cool item. It's a nice sort of like coat, I guess you could call it. And the stripes by default are white. For some reason in SFM they're black. It's just that I struggle to fit this snow scoper in a lot of loadouts. And it only really looks sort of in place with things like the cold killer, where you it's very winter themed. But if you try and wear it with other sniper cosmetics, the vast majority in fact, it just kind of looks out of place. However, it is still very frequently used and that's what makes it overrated. The Your Worst Nightmare is a really good example of a hat that I really, really like myself, but think it's overrated. And that's okay to think that way, like it's fine if you like something and think it's overrated, it's completely cool. But I think it's really overrated because it doesn't work well with most cosmetics on Sniper. I mean, yes, there are a select few that look amazing with the Your Worst Nightmare for the Sniper, but that's pretty much all that people wear with it. Like, there isn't really much room to experiment with it, mainly because it's like, some things just don't look right with it, and that is most things, unfortunately. But the sets you can make with the Your Worst Nightmare is are actually like really cool and I really enjoy all of them. I think they're awesome and I do really like the hat. I just think it is a little bit overrated. So next up we actually have a multi-class item, but it is worn by the sniper and the spy only, so no other classes can wear it. And this is going to be the double cross com. The double cross com is the single most expensive item that can be crafted, coming in at 23 refined. And it covers the eye of whatever class it's equipped on, and the lower region of the face with this sort of bandana with a mouth print over it. Now once again, it looks really great. It's just for 23 refined, I feel like there's many other cheaper alternatives, even the villain's veil would be a nice alternative and I think the eye th sort of thing um, really not necessarily ruins the misc but definitely makes it a lot different to the other bandanas out there so if you like the eye then definitely do go for the cross com however I personally feel like the other bandana sort of miscs out there that are cheaper are probably more worth the money. But guys that's just about it for this video once again do be sure to go and check out Spikey down in the comments 
But guys, that is just about it for this video. So once again, do be sure to go and check out Spikey. His channel will be linked down in the description below. Let me know your opinions on this episode, along with what spy cosmetics you feel are overrated. That is just about it though, guys. So thank you all so much once again for watching. I really hope you enjoyed, and peace.